morning guys welcome to today's video is Thursday I'm driving. Sophie's driving no. you all know how much of a chicken she is she's never gonna drive to me like till I was 36 years old to drive hmm. wonder where Sophie gets it from anyway welcome to today I, got, I still have my puppy yeah we still have her and she's still alive yeah, okay in her crate though yeah she's a crate puppy like she loves her crate huh she likes it because she can sleep in there and not be bothered yeah yeah so uh yesterday uh, she was really super quiet today would you say she's more active mm-hmm mm -hmm. but once you have a border collie no other breed is an active dog like doesn't it feel like that like no yeah, Peyton wants a Dalmatian yeah you know, everybody wants a Dalmatian when you see a cute little puppy so Molly is like the epitome of active dog. So even though border, even though Dalmatians are are active, like she's got nothing on Molly. Like even from birth, Molly, I don't know how to explain it. Molly moves like she's she's like rigid and got control of her. She's ready to leap tall mountains at the at the. She's ready to leap tall mountains at the sight of a fire like she's always on alert she's always ready to move and this little puppy even when she's active she's like lopey right don't you think she's lopey like she's like slower moving and more like do 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 do, do kind of like chino up to the house you can actually catch her yeah but i know she's little and i know she's small but there's nothing that compares an activity level that to a border collie i'm telling you now Tell me now, but anyway, we are headed out because it is Thursday and uh, we have no food. Like we've been going and going and going, so we need to go to the grocery store. Sophie I and I had lunch yesterday. Yeah, we yeah, like we have hardly Sophie can hardly eat with that puppy man. She's so busy, so busy, isn't she? Probably wants me to get skinny. Yeah, if Sophie doesn't get skinny, not that you have to be skinny, but if Sophie doesn't get skinny chasing this puppy around, mm, I don't know what we'll do it because she's busy every 30 minutes, every 20 minutes outside to pee. And how's she doing with her potty training? She's doing pretty good. She's doing better, right? Mm -hmm. Better today than she did yesterday. All right, let's go grocery store. She actually tells me when she needs. She is food. really good about that. She's really vocal, and she always tells us when she needs something. Like she doesn't do the like drop her nose and do circles like typical dogs. She just starts whining. She starts getting frantic, and then she starts whining. And then she starts running away from us. Yeah, so we know. They say never go grocery shopping hungry. Well, I'm hungry. I'm starving. No, we're starving. My belly's full now. We are I getting myself. we're getting a super yummy lunch, you guys. Always gotta get stuff for our horses. The guy had two bigger bags. Yeah, uh, the guy at our barn always gives our horses a care every morning. Where's the bread Gabby likes? Um, Gabby? Gabby likes this kind of bread. She's very insistent. It's good bread. Sophie and I are having salad. Sophie likes to get a small salad. She said too much of it. She like because we eat this salad like crazy. Like Gabby and Sophie will share this salad themselves. Sophie's hitting the pet aisle because she can't wait to get there. So she's she's abandoning me. Going to pet. She wants to try and find dog treats that she can have. Yeah, she wants to try and find dog treats that she can no have. Dog toys. They have no dog toys. How rude. Actually, Sophie found these sweet potato chews. No additive preservatives or colors. Let's see what else is in them. Uh, it's all sweet potato. Sophie. We also found beef potatoes. You can get these sweet potato chews. That's amazing. Okay, still $10 almost. They're on sale. So let's see what other kind they have. Um, wow, she's yeah. learning to shop for her puppy. Beef. So this only has beef in it. Um, but beef is like on the meat, like is on the yellow. Yellow? She's only allowed to have a little bit of it. Yeah. I don't know, let's just try the sweet potato. Stay safe while she's a puppy. This has real turkey and real pumpkin in it. She found this, farmer's milk bone. Let's see what's in it. So read the first three ingredients and see if you can hey, tell. See if you can tell if she can have it. Peas. Peas, she can have peas. So Sophie found pumpkin treats and they have lentils in it. So she has this list on her phone that shows the Which green foods, really yellow helpful. foods, red food, red foods. So we're gonna see if she can have lentils. No lentils, it's on the red, in the red, she can't have it. So now she's looking at baby food, baby treats. Mm -hmm. Somebody thought our puppy was deaf and she huh? already had her- Paw? Paw? Okay, just wait. 
good girl. girl. Okay, just wait till I can video it. Somebody in the comments has said she was pretty sure that our puppy is deaf. She has experience with deaf puppies, but I just wanted to tell you that this puppy, not only has she been tested to make sure she's not deaf, but she is so not deaf. If you have treats, she can hear better than anybody Daisy, on earth. Daisy, so I'm gonna show you. Sit. Just wait. Daisy. So watch this. Dizzy. Come here. Dizzy, come. Dizzy, come. Sit. Oh. No, sit. Good girl. And then watch what else she can do. She's so smart though, she already knows what we're gonna ask her. Paw. Paw. Oh, I have Caesar salad on my hand. Paw. 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 Mom, let me. Paw. 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 No, paw. Good girl. Like, she's really getting it. She's done really good she's potty training today. Confused on paw. Yeah. See, she wants to treat, so she's like, paw, paw, paw. It's true that she does not hear very well when she's playing or she has a shoe or she has something that she's not allowed to have. She doesn't hear when you say, come back here, you little butt. <laughs> come back here, you little brat. You just gotta treat her with treats. Yeah, but when you have a treat, let me tell you, she hears better than no, all the other Robert. drugs com combined. Drop. We're gonna teach her how to drop. <laughs> she's not gonna drop it. But look at in there. Our other dogs, we put them in there just for training purposes because they get excited and they go crazy. Drop. Good girl. I don't know if that's how you teach drop. We're definitely having a lot of fun with her. When I look at her, she's so tiny. And then I look at her through through the camera and she's so big. You don't have any more tweets. Like, for some reason, I always remember puppies being really hard. But all of our new puppies this year, like the two puppies we got this year, have been really easy. And... I, it almost Seven. makes me wonder if puppies are harder if you have to like get up and go to work in the morning and you have to hurry home to take care if of them. If you have a Dalmatian and you don't have any treats for them, I would suggest getting uh, baby food. Yeah, they can eat like food grade stuff, a lot of food grade stuff. <laughs> Big dogs are so jealous. Holy heck. The puppy will just be standing there, just standing there, and Molly will come over and bite her. Like, not bite her to hurt her, but just be mad and just to be like, I'm the boss of you. But she holds her own. Like, she doesn't care. She, she, like, she'll cry sometimes, like, cry out, but she doesn't, she's not scared. I got this big, huge, warm, fuzzy blanket. It's ginormous, and I'm gonna put it in this box that I showed you guys. She dropped her piece of horse poo. Oh, good. I'm glad. I do not like dogs eating horse poo. My cat probably won't fit through the hole. I know, it's such a small hole. I don't know what your dad is thinking. If you hear whining, it's this thing. Cold. She's probably for a nap. She's sad. Are you sad I made you drop your horse poo? She threw her head yet. So it doesn't look super fancy, but I promise you. It's pink, my cat's a boy. And he doesn't care. I promise you it'll be a nice warm place for them. I just, the only thing I don't know is if this is big enough. Like, and it's a bit sharp, so I might put some tape on there. I have some at the house and make it nice and soft. And I think I'm gonna have to get that Can bigger. Think your puppy will fit like no. your puppy's not our cats are not gonna fit in there what a silly Ollie's dad Ollie's this big yeah maybe Ollie's that big what's yeah. the matter for a nap she's ready for a nap I think she's probably ready for a nap this dog tells us everything she's like a Laura dog she's like me and Sophie she's like I'm really tired now oh we cut her nails today how was she with her nails terrible <laughs> we had to wrap her in a blanket so tight and Ruby had to come over and say, like, you're fine, you're fine. And Ruby bit her. <laughs> and then Ruby bit her on the head because she was making so much noise. Mostly just her ear. But yeah, she just went. It's just like this part of her ear. Yeah, her was being mean to you, huh? 
This here was. Yeah, she's tired. So uh, today we have plans with the horses a little bit later on. I'll explain later. Um, I'm going but to the puppy to the barn. yeah, we're probably gonna bring the puppy to the barn, but she won't go on the ground. She'll be stuck. She'll only be able to walk around in the car. Yeah. So before we do that, though, I'm going to try and actually I have to drive there because it's at 3:30. I don't even know what time it is. Okay. So anyway, I'm gonna try get the barn cleaned up a little bit. I need to bring all of our outdoor furniture in here. We should put it up and sit in here and like put it as a couch. So this is all that I've done. This is it. I just cleaned up all of our beach stuff and brought it in. Now I'm gonna cut this grass out here. We kind of stored it out here because there wasn't much room. I'm gonna cut this grass and then I'm gonna go up to the house and then I'm gonna see if Gabby's ready. Wait till you guys hear what she has planned for today. You're gonna be shook. Oh, we brought the puppy. Brought the puppy to the barn. So Dalmatians like horses. She's scared right now because she's like a 10 pounds bigger than them. Um, a lot more than 10 pounds bigger than them. Like <laughs> 1,200 pounds bigger than, than her. my tax set. My tax all white and black. Oh, that's so cool. So our lessons got canceled for today. So Gabby is going with all the girls from the barn to into town they're riding their horses into town to get, ice cream. to get ice cream at the dairy daisy's getting passed around can't put her down because she's had only had one set of shots but kaylee's kaylee she suits you kaylee's kind of also matching her too yeah kaylee you met oh my gosh you match her everybody matches her at this barn all right so these are three oh my gosh this is a three-way three-way love affair happening here okay so you guys know kaylee you know Gabby, but you don't know Paige. Actually, you do know Paige. Some of you guys have seen her riding in our lessons. A little little flash of her here and there. So this is Paige, and she's going to be riding with them. This is Boots, and he is a Western guy. And this is Chanel, and she's going to be riding. So this is the group, you guys. This is the group at the new barn. We have Abby. No. We have <laughs> Chanel. And then we have Abby. Who's your horse, Abby? Desi. Desi. So pretty. And it's a girl? So is this the only girl in the whole group? You got the only girl in the whole group. You should go fat. You should go first, and they'll all just follow you. <laughs> and then we have Paige and Kaylee and Gabby, and this is it. This is, these are the teenagers now. All the teenagers. <laughs> there will be no bucking in this ride, you guys. <laughs> Understand? No bucking. All right, luck. Follow the girl. We forgot our vest at home. I looked for it. I didn't see it, so I thought it was here, and now it's not here. Oh gosh. Cappuccino minute. Don't get Gabby any cappuccinos. <laughs> we already got her one. Yeah. See you later. Have fun. They're going to get ice cream. Yeah, be smart. Don't do peer pressure. No, just kidding. <laughs> I'm not embarrassing, Mom. On my way to a weekend rumble, I forgot to check where the party was at. Roaming around without any trouble, I began to ask everybody I met, singing, oh. Before long, Gabby is going to be leaving us, you guys. Before long, we will not be a part of her life. It's a sad thing, but hopefully she'll always include us and she'll always let us be a part of her, her journey. But, I mean, that is a big group of teenagers. You guys saw us at Fiona's barn where it was all 10 and 11 year olds. All 10 and 11 year olds. And then you saw us at our next barn and it was all like 12 and 13 year olds. And you see us at this barn and it's all like 14 to 16. 14, 14 to 16 year olds. So yeah, like we're moving up. I'm just really happy that it's horses instead of boys. <laughs> yeah, that's aren't you happy it's horses instead of boys? Yeah. Yeah, we're happy. We're happy with the horsing. We are gonna go and meet them where they are going. So um so you may think that I'm super overprotective, but they are all really young still and this is not like they don't usually take their horses to go um get ice cream they're taking their horses into town to get ice cream and they have it all blocked out like they have it all mapped out they have it all figured out they're all super mature responsible kids i think that it'll help them knowing that we're going to meet them there so if they have any problems we can you know they 
they could also call us. Yeah, they could also call us. They have phones. But anyway, yeah, we're going to go. We're going to get ice cream, and then we're going to go where they're supposed to come out of the woods into town, and we'll meet you guys there. And then... Okay, so we're at the ice cream place that the girls are going to come. So we're going to get ice cream. Sophie and I haven't had sugar for a while, so we're going to have some sugar. You want ice cream? Yeah, we are going to have some ice cream. All right, let's go see if we can figure out how to work it. So the ice cream place is this little window. So you can drive up with your horse. Drive up with your horse, come here and take your order. And they just need to stand there. Yeah, they can just park right here with their horse. I got maple walnut and Sophie got... Bear tracks. Bear tracks. Okay, Sophie's like, what's bear tracks? I am a ice cream person. Like, ice cream is my favorite food on earth. And I know every single flavor. And mm, it has Reese's in it. Yeah, mm, so yummy. They took the Trans Canada Trail. So basically, what that is is like this trail system that goes across Canada. And most people take their four wheelers on it, and some people take their horses on it. Like it's a widely used trail system. It looks like this. It's like just like, it's just like a dirt road. But I see them. Look at you guys. Ooh. Way down there, they make great time. Oh, oh, oh. Are you guys tired? Are you guys hungry? I was thinking we should have brought food here because McDonald's. you guys want McDonald's? Yeah. Do you want us to go get McDonald's or do you guys want? We have food at the dairy where you get the ice cream. They have food there. Okay, you guys are gonna. Get you're there. still gonna go. Okay, ready to go? Yeah, we're still gonna go. <laughs> we're gonna. I'm not gonna last Then Kaylee's like, Kaylee and Gabby are like, okay, go get me food. We'll get you food, Kaylee. Okay, we'll go there. Uh, what do you guys all want a hamburger or something? Like, what do you want for McDonald's? Fries. Fries? Please. What do you want? I'm good. I'll get a quarter pounder meal. That's what Gabby always gets. I'll get a McDouble. McDouble, quarter pounder meal. No, I'll take the quarter pounder meal. Brunch. Quarter two quarter pounder meals. What are you gonna get? Are you sure? Okay. Okay, this is the plan. No. The little show behind the skate park they're gonna go after we visit that. It takes up to my house. So my house real quick my dad wants to say hi to Boots. Okay. He wants to see this guy. Okay. And then that leads up to the dairy, my road. You can take my road and then there's a little oh, trail to get to the dairy and then that's no, 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 Dairy, no, 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 that's no, no, no. nice. I'm getting sprayed <laughs> by horse pee first time. <laughs> Kaylee's like, I am out. Oh, no horse pee for me. <laughs> well, so Tex, bad. you're getting covered in horse pee. <laughs> The only thing to do You don't have to look no We have our own little parade. <laughs> Horses in the park, you guys. Nothing to see here. Move along. We should get pony rides. Chino's actually handling this all really well. <laughs> Is that Gabby that said that? Gabby! Be shy! I have to be so humble when the rest of the world doesn't care about a thing. It's such a waste of a general. Okay, I, I'm. That was fun. That was so fun. All those kids were so excited. There was this one boy, super handsome boy, and he's like, yeah, I want to ride one. Do you guys have your license? I have my license. Let me ride one. I'm like, which one do you want to ride? He's like, like yeah, I, I got a sore knee. Like, you know, I'm good. I saw that car who asked. And then Gabby says, I got a sore knee too. <laughs> and they all ran away. Gabby's a fighter. Like, how did that happen? Sam, your daughter. 
Your daughter is a fighter. Good. No, it's not good. She talks back to boys. <laughs> she talks back to boys. She's gonna be with us forever. She's never getting married. She's never getting married. We stopped to get the McDonald's because these two girls can't go anywhere without having to eat because they don't eat properly before they go. I agree. Gabby had hot chocolate. Okay, so Gabby, let me tell you how you grow up and get married and move out of the house. You be nice to boys. You don't <laughs> scream at them. Like she sees a boy, like he was a chunky boy. Wasn't he cute? And Gabby screams at him, calls him out. <laughs> was it good? People are mean. People are mean. Yeah, like, like, like this guy got mad at us for walking on the lawn, and that's been literally it's been like a coffee shop for like as long yeah. as I can remember. It's never been private property. It's a and we walked shop. not even on the grass. We walked along like the gravel because we didn't want to walk along the road. Tina's been, been so like, good. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's cool. Oh, Another lady Somebody ran out of their house. Like oh, I love it. Like so what? Who's been the worst horse? Um, I think they've all taken their turn. Oh, that's great. All taking their turns. Yeah. Tax has been good. Mm -hmm. That was the only thing he was bad for. Oh, and he barely did nothing. Like, Look at get off of his butt. Chino, get off of his butt. He's like, he's thick though. <laughs> he's thick though. <laughs> oh my gosh. You guys are crazy, but this is so fun. Like, I always dreamed that we'd ride our horses into McDonald's or something. Never dreamed that we'd actually do it. You guys are like driving your horses in for ice cream. My horse is suicidal. Same with mine. When you're hungry enough, you'll eat anything on a horseback. Can horses have fries? I think so. Potatoes. Potatoes. And salt. They can have salt. I don't know. Oh, she's Louise. He's like, give me the. <laughs> yeah, give it to me. You know what's funny is that Tex is the only horse that's not in this herd yet. I know, and he's the leader of all of them. Yeah, and he's the leader of all of them. You got the leader horse. You got the lead horse, Kaylee. The back is fully dark now. Um, you guys should know that this this ride was completely orchestrated. The girls planned it. They made a plan. They had parental support. There were a couple of roads that were a bit busier than we felt comfortable with. So all the parents met at different checkpoints and we supported them and made sure that they were able to cross the road safely and easily. <laughs> um, they didn't just try this on their own. We, like I said, we had checkpoints that we met them and that we, um, that Go to make sure everybody TikTok. was. Finn and Sophie, I posted two new TikToks. So we made sure everybody was safe. We took everything slow. It took us, this is our first nighttime ride. Sam and I followed behind them with our lights on. The only thing that we should have had was more reflective clothing. A couple of the girls had a few things that were reflective. Our, I thought I had our vest. But our vest, it wasn't here. Like I couldn't find it at home. And then when I looked here, it wasn't in our bin and I thought I brought it. So it's the one thing that we really need to work on. But I'm really proud of these girls. They did amazing. It was awesome. Girls, you, hopefully you can ride on the weekend. Gabby, you're gonna be so sore. Hello, big guy. We're gonna put some medicine on your leg again. That's your baby brother. He, or your baby sister. He's gonna be, she's gonna be riding beside you one day on the trails. All right, here's Abby. Abby, did you have fun? Yeah. Would you do it again? Yes. Have you ever ridden in the dark before? No. Oh yeah, that was so super fun. I loved it. She was a, she's a rock star. She's I independent, know. eh? Yeah. She's like, where are the other girls? There's only boys in this group. I would have got my other horse in I ride, but. I think you picked a good one. A lot, so oh yeah, good choice. Good choice. <laughs> have your yummy supper. All right, I got Chanel here. Chanel, was yes. it fun? Yes. Would you do it again? Yeah, definitely. Have you ever driven in the dark before? Ridden in the dark? No, I don't think so. Did you like it? Yeah. I thought it was cozy. At least it wasn't too cold in the night. Like, it was a good... It was perfect. It was a perfect yeah. night. Hey, Paige, did you like it? Yeah. Is your bum sore? Yes. <laughs> Would you do it again? A little yeah. bit earlier in, in the, the day. day. Yeah. The night kind of scared me a little bit. Hey, Jerry. will be back in a long time. 
Oh, well, you don't realize how hard it is. How many selfie stops did you make along the way? Zero. Oh, wow. None. Um, have you ever ridden in the dark before? Um, not out of the arena. Did you like it? Yeah, it's yeah. fun. Like, yeah. I'd like to go out in the dark. Yeah, the I'd like to go on, on a... Cars, like, you could actually get a light to put on their head. I could be like a miner. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that'd be cool. That'd be so cool. Chino, you deserve that carrot, big boy. You did such a good job. Thanks. Sorry you didn't get any McDonald's. They didn't he share the good, McDonald's. Yeah, he was really good. Man. Did he gallop? Man, he oh, went. good boy. Don't you know that you're beautiful?